Okay. Now, we're done with that, and I want to speak on today. I had posted online, nigga, did y'all see Eddie Long, nigga? I'm going to drop the bishop because he disrespected that title. So he don't get bishop no more. But, nigga, I'm going to ask that y'all go on Facebook. And those of you guys that are on my Facebook anyway, y'all seen that shit today. That nigga got a picture out. This motherfucker said he's gone vegan now. <laughs> that nigga said he's... Nigga. Oh, my God. Listen. I'm going to need Auntie Faye cooking, uh, uh, cooking with Carolyn. I'm going to need I Heart Recipe. I'm going to need my motherfucking ass, and I'm going to need two or three more motherfuckers to get this nigga spread together. One of them old school motherfucking soul food spread, because that nigga need to eat. That nigga look horrible. Oh, my God, he looks so horrible. And at first, I wasn't going to really let that nigga have it. You know what I'm saying? But then I got to thinking about how that nigga was just taking ass. You know what I mean? I got to thinking about how all this motherfucker was doing all this bullshit to motherfuckers. You know what I mean? To these boys. I'm going to call you back, nigga. But I was thinking about all that bullshit, and I was like, you know what? Fuck this motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? Nigga, at once upon a time, nigga, you was like one of the motherfucking ports and D's. Now, nigga, you look crazy. You look crazier than the motherfucker. Hairline still fucked up. You know what I'm saying? 57 look like he got some issues. Because I'm like, wait a minute. When you get to losing that much motherfucking weight and your protein and all that old type of shit, nigga, your levels is off. I'm going to need you to get some blood work done stat. Because I don't know. You saying that this is a vegan diet? Nah, nigga. That ain't no vegan diet, nigga. You need that Popeye's Tuesday to get down. Yeah. You need to say, uh, fuck, vodka, uh, fuck, morning star. Um, nigga, I'm gonna need you. Ha I'm gonna need you to have the regular peanut butter and jelly sandwich with whole uh milk, bottom and dick. Nigga, you need all that real shit, cause you looking crazy than a motherfucker. Ain't none of that shit looking right on you, nigga. No, still the same size though, cause that motherfucker was taking up the whole guy. I said, nigga, this nigga's nose is still in the picture, ain't it? But the rest of your shit looking crazy, nigga. What the hell? Oh my god. Mm -mm. That nigga look like a clean up ass Ned DeWino. That motherfucker, his shit is still bozoed out the game a little bit. You know, but now he got all this is drooping and hanging off of him and shit. And at first he was a muscular man. Nigga, that ain't vegan, nigga. Nigga, you need to hit the weed. You know what I mean? You need to hit the weed. Dude, somebody's lying to you on a regular motherfucking basis. Okay, because if, if if this right here is what that vegan diet do, nigga, you don't need that. Somebody got you fucked up. Because that right there, nigga, don't look very healthy at all. Okay, I'm going to ask that y'all go on over there, take a look at that shit if you need to. Because that motherfucking shit looks look so motherfucking crazy. Mm -mm. Nah. Nah, 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 nah. I ain't buying the vegan diet, nigga. I'm not buying it. You want it to go back on saturated fat, motherfucking, uh, full fat, high protein, uh, nigga, go, nigga, you gonna fuck GMO, nigga. You need all that, okay? You need all that. He looks a mess, so I'm done with that. Next thing we're gonna talk about is this morning I woke up, Cynthia was going off on the feed, and... She was talking about <clears throat> Gabby and motherfuckers are still, you know, saying shit about this baby's hair. Man, that is crazy as a motherfucker to me. I'm like, oh my God, oh my God. How miserable do one motherfucker got to be to go in on some kids? And then, you know, keep, keep this shit going. You know, going on different websites and shit. Just, you know, all in feeds and shit and just saying fucked up shit about kids. For real? Is this what the fuck we coming to? Now, these motherfuckers ain't giving a fuck the fact that we at the motherfucking Olympics just taking names and numbers around this motherfucking nigga. I seen a nigga the other day on a motherfucking horse the other day. I said, niggas, we doing this now too? Nigga, we taking over this motherfucking shit. Motherfucking sister got shot put the other day. I said, oh, shit. And she looked every every bit of Shaniqua or some motherfucking body. She was a thick ass girl, big as a motherfucker. And motherfucker said, look, check this out. You need me to throw that over there? It's going to be no problem, okay? That bitch got the gold on that shit. We got the gold in motherfucking swimming. We beat the shit out of that motherfucking gymnastics. Tonight, I'm going to watch 
the motherfucking um, uh, track and field back coming on tonight. Okay, I was watching that shit last night. I said, oh my God, them motherfuckers was getting, them chicks was running so goddamn. It was a sister from the U.S. The other night I was watching. She had blonde hair, little curly dude, little, you know, what y'all call it, naturalista, or whatever y'all shit y'all call that shit. You know what I'm saying? Motherfucker said, fuck Revlon. We ain't incriminating none of that shit. We ain't doing optimum, none of that more. QP, none of that more motherfucking shit. Go, just go ahead on. I'm gonna need you to, I'm gonna need you to bleach it though. But uh, I can go down there to go get me a little haircut at the barbershop, nigga. And we're gonna just let it do what it's gonna do. But she was sexy than the motherfucker. Now, mind you, I don't need no pussy. Okay, but she was so pretty. She had this honey blonde, Chlorel, uh, 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 Miss Chlorel number 26, honey blonde motherfucking, yeah, little whoop de do little cut like this right here, man. Oh my God, she was so pretty to me. And that bitch was getting them up. I mean, that bitch had wheels on. She was just gone. Booty chicks and everything just moving. That motherfucker was getting it. I said, oh my God. So today... Let's get and ready to be back on track and field, but I think the niggas is coming back on. Them motherfuckers was looking good, too, with dicks to the side and shit. I was like, damn. These motherfuckers running. This whole nigga, all his nuts and everything just went to one side. Fuck it. Huh? Oh, my God. Now, see, one thing about chicks, you know what I'm saying, we'll get a little camel toe. It'll go between the man and the boat, and then, you know, some sometimes it tickle, it be tickling a little bit. I got to admit that shit, you know what I'm saying? Sometimes you got to go in and hide your leg up and pull that motherfucker out just slightly. But with a man, though, when y'all shit is up in there, nigga, that shit look crazy, motherfucker. Nigga, that ain't where it's at. I was looking at them motherfuckers the other day. I said, oh, God damn, all this nuts and bolts and everything was all on the motherfucking thigh. I said, oh, shit. Last night, motherfucking Chinaman, shit, he was trying to go over that motherfucking stick. Motherfucking dick got caught up with that motherfucker, huh? Fucked up the gold and every goddamn thing. I think it was from China, Japan, one of them motherfuckers, Bangkok, one of them motherfuckers. I don't know. It was a little Chinaman, though. That motherfucker went all that goddamn thing, whole motherfucking nuts and shit hit that thing. Uh, disqualified. Ain't that a bitch? That motherfucker, I know he mad though, but low key nigga, that means you got a big ass motherfucking dick, nigga. Your dick made this whole motherfucking thing right here fall down on the goddamn um, Olympics yesterday. Yeah, 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 yeah. Nigga, so I'm, I'm really I'm really into that shit. I kind of feel bad that Serena, you know, had her little issue in the beginning. Her and her sister, you know what I'm saying, had their little problem. The motherfuckers didn't really, you know what I'm saying, they got put out or whatever. You know what I'm saying? Barbie and them thought that they had really done some shit. You know, them bitches was over there showboating like a motherfucker. I was like, Serena, now you know we from coming. If you don't grab this motherfucker right here. Because this bitch was showboating her ass off. I was like, yeah, bitch, you don't even know. You know what I'm saying? Just, she know about three or four motherfuckers. Okay, that she ain't got to do nothing but get this motherfucker a colossal burger, a dime bag of weed, and twenty five dollars. Nigga, they will fuck you up on the spot, huh? On the spot, nigga. You don't quit calling me. Damn, I'm gonna call you back in a minute. Damn, that's that's what happens when you let a nigga put his finger in and taste it one time. Damn, damn, motherfucker. Yeah. Next motherfucker gonna wanna go to the movies. Ain't that what be next? Let's go to the movie. Let's sit at the top, nigga. Not, stop that shit. Yeah. Can't even watch Will Smith and then write this nigga up in here trying to do some of this shit. Nigga, you don't knock it out. Fuck up out of here. I decline. How about that? I didn't go to the motherfucking movie with this motherfucker. Can I take you to the movie? Nigga, what you trying to do, nigga? Is they still doing that shit, nigga? That shit played out with the inkwell. Is motherfuckers are still going to the movies and trying to get pussy on the side? Nigga, please. Nigga, now I'm going to be like Nikki. If you stand with your motherfucking baby mama and shit, nigga, we can't fuck. I'm just going to tell you that right now. Nigga, our shit's going to end swiftly. If I come to find out that you stand with a motherfucking woman too, now I do give Fizz credit because, yes, it was an oil spill down there, okay, and motherfuckers was displaced for a while. But nigga look like he was in an apartment any motherfucking way though. I'm just saying. I mean, I don't mean to be disrespectful or nothing like that. But nigga, it's not it's not it's not like he was in a home and you had you know what I'm saying? Nigga look like he was in an apartment any motherfucking way. Nigga was probably behind on this and that, motherfucking, you know what I'm saying? I don't wanna break the lease and all that old type of shit. But since motherfuckers had to move any motherfucking way, you know what I mean? Then in there for you can break the lease, it was no problem. So, but I'ma just move in to Monisa's spot. Okay. I 
I ain't got nothing to say with it. Fuck it. You know what I'm saying? They like it, I love it. But the shit sound crazy to, to me when she come talking about, I want some of your sperm. Why should I have, you know what I'm saying, two or three baby daddies when I can, them niggas are still fucking sideways on the side, ain't they? Them motherfuckers are still fucking one another low key. That's what the fuck they doing. They still fucking one another. And somebody ain't telling the truth. Okay? But Nikki said, look, check this out. I want me a girlfriend any motherfucking way. Now, last night when I was watching, what was that shit? The after show, whatever damn thing. Now, old boy that used to go with Nicki Minaj. Nigga, why is you up here showing out and shit? See, nigga, the loudest motherfucking nigga in the room is the weakest one. Okay, let me just go and say that. Nigga, why is you standing all on this and showing the fuck out? See, because I'm going to tell you one more again. <clears throat> when niggas got hurt by the last woman that they in, they going to do some real stupid ass shit. Okay, they going to act out. They trying to find them a 10. So then therefore they can show her off to you to make you feel a particular kind of motherfucking way. Then they, then they also might be fucking a whole bunch of different bitches. Just random bitches. Just showing the fuck out. Wilding out and shit. That shit he did last night. Nigga, bye, nigga. Goodbye. Whatever. Okay. Yeah. Um, I want to roll this in. And I think that's going to be about the end of it, too. Um, that, uh, nigga, you see they selling off all the prints and shit. That's fucked up. Nigga, they selling the whole motherfucking compound everything. Paisley Park, all that shit, nigga, is getting sold. Damn. That lets you know that he was actually a selfish motherfucker. Because out of all these bitches that you was fucking, Apollonian and all, none of these motherfuckers could get their name on nothing. You mean to tell me you didn't sign nothing for none of these bitches to have nothing? We can fuck, though. But uh, all this all this purple rain shit, all this shit is all me. Okay? This is all me right here. I, nigga, I'm tripping. You know? And it takes a real selfish motherfucker to never be married. You know, to, to never really be married and sustain this. They're constantly going in and out of divorce. I think he was divorced like, what, once or twice or something? I know old girl that was on the, the wives of motherfucking uh, Hollywood or whatever. Old girl, remember her? I think she was the only one that really had a baby by him. But I think he was... Uh, married one other time other than her though. I'm not totally sure, but either way, bitch, you didn't get no insurance on this motherfucker when y'all was married. I'm just understand. I'm just trying to figure this all this motherfucking shit out. Motherfuckers just don't be thinking. I don't understand. I don't know. Am I the only one that think the way that I think? I don't know. I don't know, man. Because especially when you start having children and all that kind of stuff, or you become wife. Nigga, if you don't sign on the dotted line, let these motherfuckers come get this vial of blood right here. Okay, what day you say you're going to be here on the 13th at 2 o'clock? Okay, no problem. I have to make sure the nigga's ready. He can't have nothing at the 12 o'clock midnight. Don't you worry about nothing. I'm going to make sure this motherfucker is present. Huh? Y'all coming to the house and all that old type of shit too? No problem. I'll probably run that nigga some pussy. I ain't going to let him eat it though in case he fuck up a value or something. You know what I mean? Because truth be told, let me just go and say this right here. We're going to end this shit on this right here. <clears throat> Um, for those of you guys that like to go down and all that kind of shit, male and female, <clears throat> I just want you to be aware. If the motherfucker that you going down on and them motherfuckers indulge and, you know what I'm saying, all this and that, 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 it will fuck up your drug tests. I'm just going to tell you that. You know what I mean? I'm just going to tell you that right there. Okay? Yeah. It fucks up the test. You know what I'm saying? Ask Ken. Ken, they, they, they was like, wait a minute, hold on, hold on, hold on. Uh, something ain't right with this motherfucking test right here. Yeah. Yeah. Nigga, if you don't knock it off, damn. You see what I'm saying? This motherfucker's calling simultaneously. You understand? See, because let, let me tell you something. We're gonna end this shit in a few more minutes. Nigga, okay, knuckle. Shit. But, uh, but yeah. That's the key right there. Quit fucking all these niggas that you meet. Just because you need meet a motherfucker, that don't mean you got to get this nigga some pussy. Every motherfucker that you meet don't mean that you got to fuck them. Quit giving up the motherfucking pussy. Quit having all these threesomes and letting niggas take it in the dookie and all that. Quit
quit doing all that motherfucking shit. Because sometimes it'll cancel your ass out. You're giving these motherfuckers too much motherfucking leeway. You're giving them all this extra, you know, benefits and perks and black cards and shit. You know what I mean? And then at the end of the day, these motherfuckers want to talk to you about your clothes, treat you like you ain't shit, look at you down and all that old type of shit, and then gonna marry a 10. Nigga, that's fucked up. Okay? That's fucked up. What you, what y'all gonna need to do is stop fucking all these motherfuckers. Real life. This is real 100 shit right now. 100 shit. Now, I know we were talking about all this entertainment shit. Okay, no problem. We done done that. Okay? I didn't talk about the real. Fucking, I ain't gonna really watch it no motherfucking way. Y'all motherfuckers fired my Tamar off the goddamn show, nigga. What's real about it now? I can't tell. I don't know. You know what I'm saying? Because after Tamar's gone, nigga, I don't know what the fuck I'm watching it for. You know what I mean? So, uh, that's on that. That was the last motherfucking insert on that right there. But anyway, excuse me, diverted. Um, y'all quit fucking these niggas, though. Square business, real shit. All these niggas, on, they don't qualify. All these niggas don't qualify for no motherfucking pussy. You know what I'm saying? That's going to make a nigga slow down on the hunt, on the chase, on rock, trying to woo you. You fuck a nigga right off the bat. Oh, okay, I done already got that going. And then you have nothing. Now this motherfucker talking crazy. He on some CBJ. He getting all married and shit on some Kevin Hart. You know what I'm saying? This nigga Ray J. You know what I mean? Because, uh, nigga, you done done all that shit. Them motherfuckers, you know, you, you, you done put in on helping grow these niggas up to a certain, to a certain degree. And now these niggas done moved on. And now the new motherfucker is using up all the motherfucking, all the extra little benefits and the perks and shit that you done helped get this nigga to a certain motherfucking level. You ain't shit now. You know what I'm saying? R. Kelly's ex-wife, I know this motherfucker. Nigga, this nigga.